New at noon, a new ultimate fan experience is coming to the River City. So the city of Jacksonville announced its inaugural Duval Bold City Bash and fans will be able to experience a week of fan centric interactive events that celebrate the tradition and excellence of one of the biggest rivalries around. Arlana Harris tells us more about this fan experience. Hey, OK, so full disclosure, I was definitely going to start this thing off by calling the dogs, but our photographer, who is a huge Florida fan, said that he will absolutely cut the camera off immediately if I even think about it. So I'm just going to get to what's happening for the first time ever on Florida Georgia weekend. Jacksonville is throwing the Bold City Bash. It is a multi day fan experience. It's going to take over this entire area here on Adams Street, but not just here. The baseball grounds is going to be where to be on Friday night. So let's just run through it. October 29th is when it all starts when RV City opens. October 30th, Florida Georgia Welcome Center opens, but the real party starts November 1st. The weekend festivities kick off starting with the Hall of Fame induction ceremony and luncheon. After that, the Bold City Bash fanfare at Daly's Place Flex Field. It's free. It starts at 1 p.m. Then the festivities continue on Friday evening with a block party along Adams Street and a Philip Randolph Boulevard. I'm talking live music, giveaways, food trucks, a beer garden. That's at 4 p.m free to the public and then again right here at the baseball grounds UGA and Florida's baseball teams are going against each other and directly after that country music artist Brett Young and two other artists will be performing right here at the stadium followed by a fireworks show and that all leads up to game day where there will be festivities in Daly's place right before the game with new plans for the Jacksonville landing we want to make sure that we enhance the experience we all put our heads together and said, let's make sure we have a place where everybody can get together and have a good time. So it definitely sounds like a fun weekend and you can start buying tickets for this on September 3rd. Here at the baseball grounds, I'm Lana Harris, First Coast News on your side.